All right, there it is in all its splendor. That is a 2023 Flying Cloud. It's an Airstream 25 FB model. It's just absolutely beautiful. We're gonna take a look inside. I'm Duke, your video host, and this is Duke's RV. I appreciate you tagging along. You see it's got that big awning there that runs the length of the coach. Some nice looking alloy wheels. A little loud out here on the freeway. We're gonna go on inside. I'll just give you a peek at it from the back before we do. That's an Airstream. All right, so let's take a look inside. That's what you wanna see. I'm gonna go ahead and close this door so it'll be a little quieter in here. All right, so I'm going to uh, give you a view of it from this angle right here. So you've got this big open area here. I, 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 this, they have another model, it's a 28, but this one is very open as well. I'm surprised. You've got a lot of uh, space here for quite a few folks to hang out. There is a dinette area. You've got these uh, windows like on a scenic rail car. That's pretty cool. You want to open those up. They've got the privacy shades there. You can close them up. And uh, just a panoramic view. Let's see if we can get some lights on in here. Take a look at the uh, stainless steel sink and that residential fixture there. you got storage overhead. Looks like an airline uh, motif there. You got a place to hang up your keys and things like that. The TV's located right there. Got a skylight up there. You see the ducted AC. Just taking a look. And this one has a uh, spice rack. Check that out. All right. Let's see what's up here. We got a cabinet right there. Some hidden residential hinges this is quality this is all tight stuff here all right so i'm going to uh change my screen a little bit so we can get a good view here this is a, a wardrobe area here it's got a place to hang stuff up a shelf right there to stow things away i guess there is a uh, oh, this is a bathroom light let's go ahead. this is for the shower you have a standalone shower unit right here with a uh, nice shower head and then it's got this little clothesline you can hook up right there if you want to dry some items right there that's a nice touch so you got a place to sit down in the shower if you want to let's take a look in the bedroom in one second well, let's take a peek at this uh, bathroom here you got a, a well-positioned toilet plenty of space stainless steel big mirror there and then this will open up also there's storage up there so now, this is a nice looking bathroom here, a little hook there, very stylish, you can hang up a towel. Now, there's a curtain here if you want to close the uh, bedroom, and then there's another curtain here if you want to close off the bathroom area as well. And you have these two twin beds here, nobody has to climb over each other. Storage all the way around, so you've got plenty of spaces there. There's a nice drawer right here that you can open, that's a big drawer, and uh, there is some... Uh, just looking here, it looks like there's storage underneath there also. I don't want to lie to you. Got these two twin beds. This is very comfortable. Hang out in here. You can have a TV back here. You can watch a little TV. All right, hey, just wanted to give you a quick view of the Airstream 25FB. If you want a better video, just send me an email. There's some specific things you want to see. But I wanted you to take a look I had a request for somebody who wanted to see inside here check out that door you got a space underneath underneath this uh, sink right there all right it's Duke at Duke's RV I appreciate you tagging along my uh, phone number is 281-467-0659 you can send me a text 281-467-0659 let's see what we got right here there is a uh, a door that opens up and there's a couple of uh, storage containers there so that's pretty cool so I'm probably missing a few other things let's see what's over here is there something oh look at that huge drawer right there so we got a lot of storage in this one appreciate you tagging along I have to work on my video production but I appreciate you watching this video thank you so much if you'd be kind enough to give me a thumbs up I will appreciate that